Greetings, my family in Christ. I hope you are doing well today. There is a very, very small, tiny little blue butterfly. They're so pretty. I had to catch it before it flew away. I hope you are doing well today. We had a lot of rain yesterday, thank goodness, to give us what to replenish our plants and wells and so forth. And hope you all were safe wherever you may be and if you're getting rain today it was a nice peaceful day in a way it was really cold if it had been 32 it would have been a blizzard it was a lot of rain a lot of wind and just all day i think we even had some into the night so the garden is wrapping up the uh, weeping uh, butterfly bush it's still putting on a little at its ends, but it's wrapping it up, and the monarch caterpillars have all gone, and I have three chrysalises. This is what's left. They ate pretty good. I learned a few lessons this year. Number one is do not let the stinkweed grow, which attracts all the bad bugs that the caterpillars don't stand a chance against and once I took those out of here things improved greatly with just the way it was too many uh, predators evil evil things so uh, there may be another monarch to come through and maybe lay some eggs and we might have another batch but it will be late and we will worry about them getting on their way uh, before the cold weather we've had some to catch out of their chrysalises as late as early November, I believe. And I just could only hope that it made it to where it was going to go. So there are a few bees out today. Um, not many, it's just after the rain, the pollen may even be washed away, I don't know. But we will, I'll try to keep my eye on it. I'm going to read today's verses. We've got Psalm, Psalm 66, 1 through 4. Shout joyful praises to God, all the earth. Sing about the glory of his name. Tell the world how glorious he is. Say to God, how awesome, awesome are your deeds. Your enemies cringe before your mighty power. Everything on earth will worship you. They will sing your praises, shouting your name in glorious songs. Isn't that a beautiful praise for God? Just write that down and repeat it every morning. And the second one, Psalms 93, verse 1. The Lord is king. He is robed in majesty. Indeed, the Lord is robed in majesty and armed with strength. The world stands firm and cannot be shaken. How about that? And, you know, that reminds me of the verse in Revelation that's my favorite. I'm not sure of the uh, source. I think it's 3 7. I'm not positive. But whatever God opens, no man can close. And what God closes, no man can open. And that, if you've got that power behind you, we can do all things as long as it's in God's name and to his glory, not ours. And that we seek to do his will in all things. And we listen for his voice and put on his armor and we are the path will be cleared and we will be rewarded in heaven because god is making that place for us right now and i cannot imagine how glorious it will be so praise his name always always just praise his glorious name we will all be triumphant because he paved the path for us he died on the cross took away our sins, and we can just shout the victory and just praise his name. We don't have to do anything else in this world, but do praise his name. Till tomorrow, my friends. Amen.